everyone, this is CJ, your property consultant, your real estate buddy. So, papakita ko naman sa inyo today is yung uh, 35.55 square meters na naman yung last place. And then, a quick tour ni Ben sa mismong tower na sa lobby. Since last week ata, pinalik na yung regional arrangement na lobby. So, may couch na. Back to normal na. So, hindi pa rin tapos yung pandemic. Siyempre, with safety measure pa din. So, yung priority ni uh, Greenfield is yung safety ang mga tao dito I'm um, viewing po So this is the lobby uh, Yes, 36 Papa 36 Papa uh, 47 India 47 India. Coordinate lang po namin sa admin. Okay, thank you. So, at yung front desk dito. Yan. May bell plate tayo. Tapos, elevators. Mailboxes. Uh, may mga couches na binalik na nila. Actually, malaki siya. Yung lobby namin. High ceiling. Para hotel, another uh, uh, waiting area. Merry Christmas, everyone! Ayan, dito yung main entrance. Okay na po? Okay. Thank you. So, dito sa Queen Oaks Place, ayun nga nag-access uh, ako sa elevator na security kasi I don't have the uh, access card. Once they turn over na sa inyo yung unit, um, the admin will give you um, access card. So, kung ano pag asang floor ka lang, yun lang yung pwede mo ma-access. And then, the amenity areas. And then, if you have parking, ma-access mo din yung basement natin. So, we have five levels of basement parking dito. So, ayan. This is our the residential elevator. We have five elevators dito sa Twin Oaks Place East Tower. And, guys, low density si Twin Oaks Place. We have 18 units per floor lang. So, no elevator traffic na yun dito. Okay, magyantay na matagal. And then, the main purpose nga pala dun sa access card dun sa elevator natin is para sa security ng mga residente natin dito. So, para at least, walang ibang tao makakakit dun sa floor nyo, makaka-access dun sa floor nyo. Kayo-kayo um, lang, mga, mga kapitbahay nyo in that specific floor. So, we have CCTV this uh, elevator, um, every corridor is my CCTV, and then monthly po nagkaroon ng elevators ng talans guys, one thing na nagustuhan ko dito sa Twin Oaks Place is pet friendly so, sa mga pet lovers dyan, dog lovers dyan so this is the uh, hallway Here, 
Tapos mo naman natin si 35.55 square meters. So, actual unit na to. Um, door lock system. Ayan siya. And use keys or pin code. So, battery operated siya. So, pagkapasok nyo, hindi siya critical condominium unit na kitchen kagad or toilet at kagad. So, this, you can put your uh, couch here. So, living area siya. Maganda siya. Hindi siya yung um, typical condominium na pagpasok ng kitchen and the toilet and bath. So, ayan. Maloy siya. The unit comes with the uh, one speed pipe air and then so bare unit you can do whatever you want, diba? It's paganda pag bare kasi nasa sayo kung paano mo iwasan yung unit mo. And you can mamili ng furniture. Guys, so this though, hindi mo maririnig yung kapitbahay mo. Kahit anong katok mo dyan, concrete talaga siya. Sobrang solid niya. Wala kang maririnig na iyak na bata, wala kang maririnig na tahol ng aso. Kasi nga, ako guys, I personally, I really love this unit talaga. Kasi studio type siya ako, but hindi siya yung typical condo na pagpasok mo kitchen and then toilet and bath. This is your main door. Ayan. Ang door mo yan, hallway. Pagpasok mo, this is your living area. Diba? Living area mo yan. And then, you can put partition here. Kung gusto mo talaga siya gawin one bedroom. Kasi yung size na guys, pang one bedroom mo talaga siya. So, you can put partition here. Or, pwede din yung division. Divider, pwede. Para, yung bedroom mo siya dito. Banda sa window. So, maganda mag-dramatic guys. Kasi, Naka-floor to ceiling glass window kayo, malaki yung window. Ito talaga isa, mga, isa, isa sa mga pinaconsider ko kapag bibili ako ng sarili kong property. Gusto ko may malaking window. Ayan. Diba? Wala siyang balcony, pero you have floor to ceiling glass window naman. So, okay na din for natural light. And then guys, tingnan nyo naman yan. You have mountain view. That is in the polo. Diba? Diyan na... Uh, Aakit yung araw. So, sunrise to. Sunrise view. And then, you have mountain views. You have central business district view naman. This is your biggest central business district. So, di ba? Can you imagine that? Pag-ising mo, ito yung, ito yung may kita mo. Sunrise. You can put coffee table here. Eh. Di ba? Kape-kape ka, magdatama ka sa gabi kasi you have the city lights here. And then, guys, swear, maganda itong view na to. And then, safe na siya sa blockage kasi wala lang hinatay dito, Shaw Boulevard eh. This is Shaw Boulevard, guys, by the way. This is a Lourdes School of Mandaluyong. So, hindi na talaga siya tataas yung building. Hindi naman talaga magtataas sa building yan kasi church din to. Over here, so if you are Catholic, yeah, tatawid ka na lang. Saint Francis Church, na yan hindi ka na lalayo. Ato pa guys sa Laguna de Bay. May tubig kading makita dito, hindi lang mountains. Yeah, Laguna de Bay, that is Laguna de Bay guys. So yun, ida naman tayo sa kitchen. Ato yung kitchen niya, so yung nakatalo sa mga spag. Pagpapasok mo sa main door, tagal yung kitchen. So, you can put your fridge here. This is the countertop. The kitchen cabinet. And this is the toilet and bath. Diba? Nakatago siya. Hindi siya yung, di siya yung bubungan sa pagpasok. Hindi na naman yung provision for the washing machine. So, yung finish dito, ayan, may gato na siya. 
floor to ceiling tile. So, parang hotel siya. Diba? Yung dating niya, parang siyang hotel. The toilet. The toilet. And then, ikasa ko na mirror. Actually, ito yung kinukunan ko ngayon is as of today, ano tayo ngayon? October 19. October 19, available pa itong minute na ito. This is uh, 47th floor. Facing morning sun. Yeah. And then perfect na ito guys sa mga nag-work sa Ortigas kasi lalakaran mo na lang workplace mo na and also BGC. Dito lang yung BGC guys. Yung bridge eh, yung bridge connecting from BGC to Ortigas kasi nandito lang yun. So from 40 minutes travel from Greenfield District to BGC ay eh, magiging 12 minutes na lang. Sobrang accessible. And then guys, later, papakita, pa-flash ko din dito yung mga ideas kung paano siya aayusan. Kung ano yung magiging tsura niya kapag may mga gamit na. So, payment terms tayo. So, payment terms na ito is... Ito guys, ha, ready for occupancy na ito. Usually, sa mga ready for occupancy, kailangan spot down payment kayo noon. Like, 15% down payment or 10% down payment. Spot payment yun. Dito kay Twinox Place, we offer a ready for occupancy condominium na flexible yung payment term. So, we don't require spot down payment. Actually, 10% down payment kami dito. You can um, stagger the in 18 months. Yes, tama. So, yun 18 months. 10% down payment, 18 months po yun. So guys, karamihan sa mga clients ko na nag-iusip ko mga inquiries, they consider a pre-selling condominiums over ready for occupancy. Kasi, according to them, pag ready for occupancy daw, you have to uh, pay the full down payment, the 10% to 15% down payment of the total price. Kapag ready for occupancy, yun, yun yung sabi nila. Well, ganyan naman talaga yung um, normal term for ready for occupancy. I agree, I agree with that. But, dito kasi sa Equinox Place, we offer a ready for occupancy condominium na yung down payment niya, 10% down payment niya, is payable in 18 months. 0% interest yun. Then, isa pa sa mga promo naman is 5% to move in promo. So, kahit hindi pa kayo fully paid, hindi nyo pa natapos bayaran yung buong down payment uh, once na reach na yung at least 5% of your payment we can process your new payment again yes, di ba? saan ka pa? saan ka makakita ng ready for occupancy na nag-o-offer ng um, 18 months to pay down payment and then 5% to move in promo let's say you don't have enough um, cash para bayaran yung buong 10% down payment so Then, tayo sa 18 months to pay down payment. And then, after 18 months, si 90% balance, pala ito siya ipasok sa bank financing. Mm -hmm. So, I can provide assistance on your application. Provide nyo lang yung uh, income docs nyo, like COE, PC, yun yung mga uh, usual mini-mini bank. So, tutulungan kita sa application nyo. So yun guys, ipa-flash ko lahat ng mga ideas na pwede nyo naman kasi yun na to. So, at least, pagkaroon kayo ng idea, paano siya ayusan, since the unit's very bare, very bare but fully finished siya. The tiles, yung wall, ceiling. Gamit na lang talaga yung kulang dito. So yan, ipa-flash ko ayun yung mga uh, ideas kung paano siya ayusan. Here.
So again, that is our um, 35.55 square meters. Tayo nga lang tatanggalin ko sobrang init. So kung may mga questions pa kayo or gusto nyo pa ng more photos of the unit or sa building natin, yung Twinos Place, um, you can call me guys. So lalagay ko yung contact details ko sa description box below. And then kung gusto nang computations, just send me your emails and then sasandan mo kayo ng quotations or sample computations, um, payment terms and then other details email nyo. And also, please do subscribe. Kung hindi pa kayo napag-subscribe sa akin, subscribe nyo ako para updated kayo sa lahat ng mga real estate vlogs ko. So, next vlog ko kasi, 31 square meters and then studio yon And then after the 31 square meters, mag-penthouse tayo. Tutur ko kayo sa penthouse ni Twinox Place. As in, swear to God, ang ganda nun. Sobrang taas ng ceiling niya. And then, corner unit, floor to ceiling. And if you guys um, want a weekly updates through emails, you can DM me sa Instagram real estate account ko. And also dun sa real estate Facebook page ko. So, today yun lang yun guys na change out dito. Sobrang init. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time guys. Kita kita tayo sa real estate vlogs ko. Again, this is CJ Yontilia, your property consultant, your real estate buddy. Bye!